What's up, y'all? It's your boy Tim Ease. Tim Ease. It's not Ty. It's not Ty Ease. It's not Tim Ice. It's Tim Ease. Tim Ease. Today I'm gonna uh, break down this solo that Tony Taylor did at Transformation a few days ago uh, on Sunday, two days ago. Um, about two hours ago, I posted the video on Instagram. And I've had some people DM me already uh, asking me to break it down for them. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna play to the actual video that he did, and then I will play to the click, you know? Then we'll go from there. That wasn't the best. That wasn't the best, but it's cool. Uh, keeping it authentic. All right, yeah, that was it pretty slow. I know that sounded terrible, I'm so sorry. All right, all right, so now I'm gonna try to explain the intricate parts, the cool parts, the cool feels. So I'm gonna start with this feel right here. It's the first one he did, the first big feel he did. Uh, it goes like this. All right, so. First of all, before I continue, uh, he used, he went. So he hit the kick four times, duh, 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 right? But I just made it two to make it easier for myself, so I went. Right, the reason I did that is um, my legs are kind of skinny. My legs aren't the strongest, so, and I'm playing barefoot right now, so obviously it's not the strongest. So, you know, I'm just, my leg can't do all that strong stuff that his legs be doing pretty much pause if that's even a pause anyway so uh the best way i can explain that is uh with the right left so that's like a right left right kick kick that's how it starts like feel me right left right kick kick that's how he starts it so uh he went from that to kind of a interesting so it's like a right, left, and then kick, kick. But the kick, kick, uh. That's what he did. So pretty much think about it right here, right? It's gonna be, um. straight singles at that last part, but he just kind of sp splashes it around. <laughs> All right, 
Um, that's the first intricate part, right? The second part, uh, where he did something pretty cool. I'll probably skip this part because it was kind of cool, chill, like. Uh, I just do that slow. One last feel though. Got the right, left, right, right, left. Right, right, left, kick, kick. And then uh, kind of a uh, right, left, right. With a choke on the right, on the last right. Think about it as right, uh, kick, kick, right, left, right. Then you put it together and it goes. Cool. Now the next part, which is kind of the cool part. Uh, so. It's typical Tony. This part's typical Tony. So it's like a trap jaw, kind of, I think. So. Uh, I'm not gonna spend too much time on that because I don't know how to teach you that. Um, it's, it's a lot. But uh, I would say one thing that he does that is crazy that I don't even think I'm doing right is like a flam on the ride and, this, um, and on the kicks, like. That, that's one thing I will point out. I'm not sure if I'm doing that part right, just so y'all know, all right? But uh, I'll do that part slow again, so it's like. Right, cool. And then the next part, which is probably my favorite part, uh, he starts, okay, I'm doing first and I'm gonna try to explain it. So. All right, so it's like, it starts with this. Uh, so it's kind of like a, so I'm sorry, it's not a right, left, left. Ignore that. <laughs> it's like, a, it's like singles. Well, on the left, uh, with the left hand, you make that a ghost note. You make that quiet. Every first right, every right, you hit the kick. So he just uh, puts the second right on the hi hat. All right. Uh, the next part. Uh, so how's it go? It's like a, the original John go like, that's what he's doing right there. I don't know if you heard about it. It's the, it's the Tony Taylor, uh, Sticks Taylor, uh, type of ch chop. I've seen it on YouTube. Somebody made a video about it. It was that chop. That's, that's kind of what he did there. He just, uh, instead of, cause this is the chop they showed. that he's kind of doing it a little differently it's like it's like right right uh it's kind of like a paradiddle i think but not really it's not a paradiddle never mind so it's like a the right right the kicks on the right right there's a pattern where every time you do a right right type of thing or every time you hit the right you hit the kick it's type of it's kind of like a calvin rogers thing so that's kind of what he does right there so he goes, I'm not going to explain that part. That was just the crazy Tony thing he did adding that. So um, next part I'm going to explain is this part. I'm sorry, but that's his favorite uh, rudiment. It's a paradiddle.
every big note, I hit the kick. Right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. This is a bear do. Ah! Ah! Okay. Stop it. You're embarrassing yourself. Okay, I don't know why that just happened, but uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so every big note of the paradiddle, he hits the kick. So that's what he's doing right there. It makes it a lot easier hitting the kick too, honestly, because I just tried it without the kick and I did rubbish. Anyway, uh, so that's what he does right there. He goes, uh, right? So that's what he did. Uh, Kind of that same thing I did. Doing that. All right, so uh, the next part, the next part is pretty chill. Ain't too much I, I can explain. What I would explain is the crazy thing he did at the end, which is very difficult. So let's go to that. Uh, let's start from this. Till now, I'm still trying to figure out if that's what he did. In my head, that's the only thing that makes sense. Um, he goes, I'll start from this part. So it's like a. So it's kind of like a kick, kick, left, right, left. But the left, the second left hits the, chokes the hi-hat. So normally people do it this way. Kind of what I do, so obviously that tripped me off. I I do this sometimes because of Tony, because I watch a lot of Tony. But yeah, that's what he did. Uh, instead of instead of using the right to start it, he used the left. Kind of crazy. And then what's the craziest part of all this is the fact that he does something I'm still trying to figure out. It looks like a flamadiddle. I think that's what it is. I don't know. If you know Tony, please tell me, because it seemed like this. <laughs> to end it, if that's what he did live, Tony, you're insane. Cause I never, I never, I can't even do it right now. Barely. <laughs> like, see, I'm missing it slow. <laughs> It's like a right, it's like a right, left, right, right, but it's flammed. Ignore what I just said. I don't know what I'm talking about. So that's what he did at the end. Um, so it's like, let's start from this part. I did what I could do. Sorry if I disappointed. All right, cool. Now I'm gonna explain how I do it real quick. Um, so what I do is I listen to it a lot, you know, try to figure out what he's doing. So um, yeah, a couple of times I do that, then I slow it down. YouTube has a feature where you can slow down the video. I slow it down by 50, 50% so I can hear everything he's doing, right? I do that, then I have an app that I have to slow stuff down as well. Uh, I'm trying to come up with an app too, so. Yeah, so I use that app and I slow it down extra and really try to figure out what he's doing. So when I figured that out, 25%, 50%, 75% speed wise, you know, and then I just keep going and whenever I get there, I get there. You know, it takes time, but once you get it, you, you, you get it. You get how to do it. You don't really get it on the kit. Once you come to the kit, it's gonna take a longer time to do. But yeah. Uh, Copying is cool and all, but at the end of the day, you still have to have your own sound somehow. I'm still trying to work on that because it's hard. I want to be like the drummers I enjoy. But yeah, I'm trying to uh, figure that out. Get your own sound, man. Get one or two things from what he did here, if you can, or what other drummers do. Get one or two things from them and make it yours. Do it in a way that you enjoy doing it and go from there. This your boy Tim Ease. Appreciate y'all for watching. 
See y'all later.